is now in the murder case against a Pinellas County mom accused of killing her toddler. News Channel 8's Ryan Hughes, he just got his hands on the arrest affidavit. He joins us live now from the Pinellas Courthouse. Ryan, you've been able to go through that paperwork. What do we know about how that kid died? Well, good morning to you both. This is a copy of the two-page report and some really gruesome details inside. But first, let's go to some exclusive video that shows the suspect in this case being taken to jail. The report says Sharice Stinson committed an aggravated battery on Little Jordan at 1.27 in the morning Sunday. She admitted he had an injury to his right leg. During a moment of frustration, the report said Stinson told detectives she struck Jordan in the face with the back of her hand. The back of his head struck a wall in their home in Largo. He had several seizures during the night and died. The report said she took his body the next day into the woods and left her boy there dead. This is what an FDLE agent had to say after her arrest yesterday. This was a complete team effort. However, unfortunately, the uh, team did not get the results we had desired. And uh, our thoughts and prayers go out to the Bellevue family. Certainly a sad outcome after all these new details are just being released. The suspect due in court behind me at 1.30 this afternoon, of course, will be there and we'll have the very latest on this story throughout the day. Back to you. It's so very 